Hey there, Armored Core fans. Uh, it's been many, many years since my last playthrough of Armored Core 3. Um, only took me three tries to uh, to beat Ace, and I just want to show you how badass I am. Yeah, I don't think I had. I don't think the iPhone came out. So this is my perspective. I'm just using a dual missile launcher and that extension that shoots four missiles to wear him down. And this I got particularly lucky defeating his uh, anti-missile extension. Jacked it, and then I at this point I only need to put a few, few rounds in him with my rifle. Now, let me just show you how awesome my flying was. We're gonna watch it from Ace's perspective. I'm such a good pilot. So, okay, am I cheesing it with the missiles? Yes. But I have such a lightweight robot. Watch when he uses the Gatling gun. He just hits nothing but thin air. That huge volley, watch this. This is not even hitting me. He's got a lock, he's just spraying. That thing should be destroying my weak little robot. Alright, yep, I'm amazing. Uh, since I have a captive audience, I'll show you my awesome swag. Uh, there's Armored Core, uh, Project Phantasma, Master Arena is still sealed. I just, I can't, I, I want to do, play them all through, so I'm not going to open this until I can beat uh, Armored Core and Project Phantasma, but I'm having, I, I have a huge difficulty in the last mission there. Uh, then we have two. Uh, another age. My favorite two Armored Core games ever, Armored Core 3 and Silent Line. Uh, I accidentally bought a... I sold all my games. I'm rebuilding my collection. I accidentally bought Japanese Sealed Nexus, so... I can't play it on this uh, backwards compatible PS2, PS3. Last Raven, one of the best games. And then we've got 4, which doesn't really work. For answer, I need Nine Breaker, which I never played that back in the day. Um, I got playing Armor Core on my PS1, and that's it. This is video is long enough. Thanks for watching.